Howdy viewers, Bobby Brown here, Guns and Drums. And for those of you who've been following my channel and watching my videos, you're probably familiar with my shooting range. Big changes here at the Bobby Brown compound. Shooting range has changed a little bit. We have removed some trees. Things are just getting a little too close. And it looks a mess now, but I'll have it cleaned up in no time. And yes, the trusty Cletus is still with us. Okay, so this is a funny story, and it goes like this. A good buddy of mine owns a Ruger Mark II, one of the older ones, and uh, I successfully took mine apart and cleaned it a couple times. Everybody knows they're a nightmare, but I was successful at it and thought, well, I'll, I'll clean his for him. I'll be that bro. So I convinced him to let me clean his Mark II, and uh, things didn't go so well. I'll never volunteer to clean somebody's Ruger Mark anything again. But anyway, after panicking, because after I put it back together it wouldn't fire, I sent it to Ruger. And um, Ruger's customer service was beyond fantastic. You know, in all my years of messing with guns, um, I find that gun manufacturers are the best at customer service. I can't recall ever having a problem with Taurus, um, Smith & Wesson, or any of them. But let me just say this, Taurus and Smith and & Wesson and CZ and everybody out there, take notice. Ruger's awesome. They are freaking awesome. A technician named Jim called me from Prescott, Arizona after I sent the gun back uh, and just pretty much told him, uh, hey, fix this thing. I'm an idiot. So Ruger called me in about three days after they got the thing, uh, after they received the gun, they called me. So uh, Jim says, hey, man, I uh, absolutely love this old gun. And I took the liberties of going through it and making it like new. Uh, I can't wait to open this box and see this thing. Uh, it was old and worn. Uh, it was a great gun. There was nothing wrong with it. But it would probably been fired a gazillion times and never been cleaned. That was the object. I was trying to clean it and put it back in good working order for him. Anyway, Jim at Ruger. Oh, my gosh. Um, a very sincere technician. You can tell he loves his job. Ruger's absolutely... Uh, a lucky uh, company to have this guy because it's so nice to talk with somebody that's really into their job and loves what they're doing and obviously Jim does love what he's doing and he took the liberty of just having a ball with this thing he said he shot 50 rounds of Winchester Super X through it cleaned it twice replaced everything in it even reblued the barrel where it was worn let's have a look at this thing this is awesome Okay, the lowdown on this pistol was, uh, it was uh, incorrectly reassembled. Yep, that's me. The hammer strut was not properly aligned. Damn, I knew it. The items repaired, barrel and receiver. He did some re-bluing. Um, the bolt and grip frame, main spring housing assembly, rebound spring, rebound spring support, recoil spring assembly and safety, all cleaned. Items replaced the ejector, the ejector rivet, the extractor, the extractor spring, and the sear. Oh my gosh, you talk about customer service. It doesn't get any better than that. Now, but Smith & Wesson, Taurus, and everybody else in the gun manufacturing business, take notice. Ruger's customer service is second to none. The technician Jim was very, very enthusiastic. Ruger's a lucky company to have somebody like him. And it's so nice to get great customer service instead of having to push prompts and um, somebody's attitude like, customer service, I'm going to help you. No, this guy was just totally into it. He took the time to shoot the gun 
Uh, it says that he shot it 50 times with some Winchester Super X. He told me it was a fantastic gun and to go on enjoying it for many, many years. I just appreciate his enthusiasm so much and the extra mile that they took to make this weapon new again just makes it totally worth it for me the end of the barrel here was worn pretty significantly on both ends and you can see they did a little touch up there and some of the receiver has been touched up and it's clean and uh i just am so happy you know i was so worried that uh this thing wouldn't function again <laughs> A good friend of mine, look at that, has got the Ruger insignia on the back of the bolt. I love that. This is a great old gun. Really, really great old gun. So glad that Ruger stands behind their product. Thank you, Ruger. Thank you, Jim, technician in Prescott, Arizona. You guys are awesome.